they have to go to the speed classes and notes are very thing uh, very useful very and broadly explained everything keep okay. myself confident because of your speed team sir thank you so much for your speed because i learn every knowledge medicine medical oncology everything from speed sir thank you so much sir i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute to dr uh, gokula krishnan for scoring a uh, rank of 61 in all india uh, for neat ss 2024 session in dm medical oncology super specialty congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir great now can we know a brief background of yours from where you started till date what you have accomplished can we know that <laughs> yes sir i am basically from tamil nadu sir i did my mbbs from government mohan kumar mohan medical college salem and then i have joined the md radiation oncology in pjm chandigarh in 2018 july then i have completed my md in 2021 Mm. at the time of 2021 actually i started the dm medical oncology but the pattern was entirely changed yes, yes. <laughs> i have <laughs> worked very hard <laughs> there is a entire chaos a very difficult path actually uh, that time 40 60 pattern so i have give the exam i got 120 rank at the time i got the dnb medical oncology but i have i myself question uh, you have to work more then uh, even though pattern is changing i accept myself whether it is medicine because i love medicine also so, <laughs> but after starting dm medical group for preparation for 6 months i don't know how to start where to start then i know about, from my friend he told about speed dm medical group in pj in chandigarh then i have started <laughs> uh, actually there is very very broad explanation in each and every uh, subjects in dm medicine group actually i love to read medicine rather than <laughs> medical oncology sir <laughs> actually first first six month i don't know where to start and it's very difficult because i am working as a uh, senior resident also from 2021 june i am doing my sr ship also in pg chandigarh so, so you are in pg right now yes no no okay. i have completed sir last okay. september i have completed okay. so i did i completed my md in 21 june then i have joined a senior resident then i have completed senior residency also because <laughs> our radiation oncology getting medical oncology at the entire harris and pace is very difficult sir. so i can't uh, leave radiation oncology work for the medicine so i have prepared first uh, 2022 uh, neat ss i have got a rank of 4500 with a good faculty member Sakshi, ma'am, and very thanks to Nasim sir, cardiology. I love to, cardiology, very good. And Madhupriya, ma'am, hematology, oncology. Santosh sir, my medical oncology background entirely I learned from Santosh sir. Still now, I, every doubt is I I have get knowledge from Santosh sir. So I basically I got rank of four thousand five hundred. So then I have confidence. Still five thousand members is behind me, even though I am from medical radiation oncology group. Then right. I have give full preparation with the active joining the live course. Uh, every time five to seven with the faculty, I attend your class every time. So 2020, uh, two uh, 23, I think 2023 need test. I got thousand eight hundred seventy. I I got second counseling in Adyar also. <laughs> okay, interesting, <laughs> so interesting. So that that is my improvement, sir. So then I I uh, very well in medicine. Then last year the exam was postponed because I want a top institute like TMH uh, then done done. So I tried again one attempt, but the exam was postponed last time. So I still tried my best. Then I completely read before two months exam. I completely read till the entire medicine only, sir. Then I see your videos before two months how to prepare. Then I completely shift to DM medical oncology. I have divided my DM medical oncology into medical oncology, then palliative medicine, hematology, oncology, and uh, pediatric hematology, oncology, sir. so i have covered everything basically from speed notes and uh, madhupriya mam hematology oncology notes and i also read entire david up from page to page palliative care everything so i have give the exam i have good confidence but there is a some doubt i have on 147 out of uh, 150 questions sir uh, but there is uh, some ai related questions are asked 10 to 15 questions <laughs> so that might be rank changing i think so anyway i am very uh, pleasant i am very I think how to how was the feeling of it. how was the feeling of uh, change in pattern back to oncology itself? I mean, uh, was that a big relief or how did you feel about? It? Because you have been upgrading yourself in the medicine side from yes, sir, yes, sir. from various level of rank and come to ten thousand. Now yes, uh, suddenly the pa- pattern back to uh, the original one yes, of uh, in the specialty of uh, medical oncology. You fe- how did you feel about it? so actually uh, in that 40 60 pattern the some questions asked from radiation oncology because i did, i wrote that exam also 
the radiation oncology around 2015 questions and the medical oncology and medicine background. Here there is zero radiation oncology question. Statistics, no question, zero. And the pediatric hematology oncology, zero questions. Only some little bit of hematology they touched. And the entire everything is practical based medical oncology questions. Sir. Not a direct or no hi-fi protocol, no hi-fi uh, regimen, chemotherapy regimen. Everything is basically in the person who is working in chemotherapy ward and they have the basic knowledge. With uh, some staging, some basic things and all, sir. Super specialty no, standard. Fully, fully yes, specialty sir. standard. Yes, sir. Fully super specialty. Because this exclusive, they written DM medical oncology. So it is very confusing <laughs> where we started. Then after writing exam, it is basically from super specialty standards, sir. So now in the entire NEET SS, only two specialty has this kind of an advantage. One is DM medical oncology, other is critical care medicine. Yes, other sir. than that, rest of all feeder branch or in between feeder branch to specialty. But here yes. is only super specialty. Now, these two specialty alone like an AIMS pattern. Not even AIMS yes, pattern, sir. more than AIMS pattern, INESS pattern. Than... And this yes, INESS pattern, we have at least 50 to 55 questions in super specialty standard and 20 to 25 questions in based on the uh, feeder branch. But here, yes, no sir. feeder branch, right? No feeder yes, branch. Yes, yes, sir. So, and uh, and the other thing is they have to study in the super specialty. Sir. That's again, that's again. A yes, sir. Yes, sir. Definitely. Task. Sir. So, it's yes, not. Uh, medicine, also, medicine question also a little bit uh, five or some mixed with the oncology based, sir. It's entirely super specialty based, basically. You gave a beautiful overview, sir. <laughs> about the journey of the exam, <laughs> journey of yourself, and how you prepared them is very. No, sir. Actually, most of the radiation oncologists they actually leave the medical oncology exam because of the last three years pattern. <laughs> but I still hold and keep okay. myself confident because of your speed team, sir. Thank you so much for your speed because I learn every knowledge, medicine, medical oncology, everything from speed, sir. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs> so that is that is our privilege. I mean, that's what we want to give also. And we, 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 whenever we give and somebody is utilized and have got some results, we are very happy. We are, truly, we are happy. Yes, sir. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> so, now, oh, now what is the plan, sir? Now, we have uh, rank 61. What is your plan? Where are you planning to? Uh... Sir, actually, now I am working as a consultant radiation oncology in Punjab, Mohali. So, uh, I want to take TMH or GCRI Gujarat, sir. Because uh, TMH have 24 seats, so might be a possibility first counseling or second counseling. Very nice, very nice. And Thank very happy also for you. And Thank what you I so could much. understand was the continuous perseverance and the persistence. And to say, okay, let it, let them change to uh, medicine side, uh, I'll read Harrison and medicine. Let, then again, they change it back to uh, uh, oncology side. Okay, now I will uh, again go to it. And the, the, the switch was just two months before the exam. Or yes, two or three sir. months before the exam, the switch happened. And the pattern change yes, happened. And again, you quickly adopted and you came back. I congratulate you, sir. Now, you, sir. Uh, what is the message that you want to give to your juniors or aspirants who are aspiring to do DM Medical Oncology? Sir, uh, who are preparing uh, DM Medical Oncology for this patent, definitely they, they have to go to the speed. Basically, Santosh Arnos is... Classes and notes are very thing, are very useful, very and broadly explained everything. And go to data from page to page, along with mainly focus on palliative care because a lot of questions comes from palliative care this time, and some repeated questions from repeated topics from uh, same uh, repeated questions from same topics like corona risk score, some paclitaxel, adriamycin toxicity, chemotherapy toxicity. There are so many repeated questions. So the data page to page is very important. And also I have um, advice to mainly practice MCQs in speed and uh, uh, daily speed MCQs also, sir. For every day, 20 to 30 MCQs. Definitely. The correct things. Now time to thank, sir. Who, I mean, there are people, there are so many people who have helped you uh, to assist you to build your career today. And I mean, yes, because of that, you have been uh, you have been here for what you are today. So yes, you can sir, use this platform. You can thank yes, whom all you want to thank. You can do so. <laughs> yes, sir. First of all, I want to thank my dear friend, Pooja, then my family, then speed team, entire faculty, sir. Excellent faculties. I have learned a lot. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs> yes. Great, sir. Now, uh, once again, we wish you all the very best and for all the success. Because this success for you has not just come overnight. That's what is yes, stopping me to stop this interview also. I'm, I'm just feeling a little hesitant to conclude it because you're quite inspiring, very hardworking, enthusiastic and very yes, motivated sir. and self-motivated. Because, <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. Because in radiation oncology, we have no other options, sir. Whether we can't quit our work also because 
this is and uh, in aims pj also we are not eligible so that is also very difficult we only have to give jipmer exam in the jipmer also mostly one seat is there so <laughs> that is very difficult so i have to challenge myself we can i can do everything so big best speed support sir um, you are you are a role model and inspiring sir i am truly telling you and uh, and the preparations for four years now no? Uh, yes, sir. From 2021 June, sir. Mm. So Almost three. Yes, sir. Yeah. Continuous on and on, on and on. Finally, yes, achieved. Yes, come on, let's go on. And and we, I, I wish I invite you. Uh, I mean, once you're free and you're settled, everything, and you want to teach somebody, I invite yes, you as the faculty to speed. Yeah, definitely, sir. I will teach. <laughs> definitely, I'm ready, sir. You can, Thank you can come much, and uh, you yes, can. Sir. You, you can uh, teach the students and they'll be really happy. Like what Dr. Santos sir did, you can also do. And uh, and you can uh, inspire so many people and whatever you learned, hard-earned points and hard-earned concepts, you can put it across. And they will Thanks. be able to get it and go on further. I, I, I invite you, I invite you to wish you and midnight and wish to come as a faculty and will be a great asset for the students. Definitely, sir. Okay. <laughs> Definitely. So with this Thank few words, you, I wish you all the very best and all the success. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.